Ryan. Ryan, call for help. Wait, 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 wait. Where's, where's my ice? I ordered ice like an hour ago. I can't have Thank scotch you. on the rocks with the rocks. And you, would you please put my dry cleaning inside my closet? Here. Is, oh, they don't work? So what do we got? We got like a party of four. I got plenty of room in my mini bar, darling. What's your pleasure? I got, I got, I got scotch. Great, you're drunk. Where'd you go? I got, oh. yeah, I no, 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 no. Don't be like that. There's always time for a drink. I met some ladies in the bar. They would love to talk to you. You could tell them about Bullfine Stop! He's lucky I didn't rip his head off and stuff it down his throat. Nice, Ryan. Real nice. The guy who went away just lost his brother. Those yeah. guys could have killed us. Greenlee, do you have any idea why I went off on him? You know how many times I told that jerk to cut you loose so you wouldn't end up in a body bag? Well, Pablo thought the danger was gone. Yeah? That, that really? Carlos... Well, the danger is as clear and as present as ever. Hey, is this your weapon? No, I got it off of him. Hand it over. What have we got? We got a gunshot wound to the shoulder. He's got a good carotid pulse. Airway's intact. He's losing blood fast. You see these boys in blue? These are not regular cops, Greenlee. These are feds. And Pablo seems a little too chummy with these guys, don't you think? Well, Pablo, you know these guys? Yes. When the Calatravas began sending death squads across the border, Emon and I called the Federals. Ah, well, the Federals did a bang-up job. You know, if you'd be dead if I hadn't jumped Listen, in the creeps are arrested, okay? They can't touch us now. What are you talking about, Green? You could have an army watching your back. It won't make any difference if a bullet meant for Pablo took you out. So you listen to me very carefully. This is your final warning. You stay the hell away from Greenlee. Lift on three. One, two, three. I have to go make a statement. Will you be all right? Yeah. I will have one of the marshals. No, I will take her, all right? Then I call you later. Yeah. Hey, 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 Pablo, you forgetting something? I don't believe so. No? No? How about a big fat thank you for saving your worthless life? Muchas gracias. Never forget that. You told Juan Pablo you'd take me home. Yeah, not until we get something straight. Forget it, I'll take a cab. Oh, that's a great idea. Get into a flaming yellow car to make it easier for the hitman to pick you off. The guys who are after Juan Pablo are in custody. Oh, so that must mean the streets are safe, right? What is it about Pablo that equals danger that you don't understand? This is you trying to scare me. You're damn straight. I want you good and scared because I want you alive. Oh, so you, you want me to look over my shoulder every five seconds? I'm fine. Until the next time the hitmen take a crack at you, Greenlee, just because two of their guns got busted doesn't mean that they're gonna lay them down and, go, you know, go home. That's what you get for watching Godfather and on cable. Greenlee, Greenlee, it's a blood feud, and it's not gonna stop until there's no one left standing. What do you want me to do, Ryan? 
blow Juan Pablo off because loving him is too risky? Write a note. Write a note, I'll make sure he gets it. Take the exit marked coward, cut and run like you did with Kendall. You know what, I don't do vanishing acts. If Juan Pablo needs me, then that's... Well, let him need it like another woman a million miles from here. Okay, the Playboy rep is not who Juan Pablo really is. Well, that's why he said he dumped you. He was trying to protect me, he didn't mean it. Well, let's pretend he did and let's live longer. You heard him say that he loves me. Oh, wait a minute, wait, wait, let's, let's just jog my memory for one second here. Who was the brown-eyed girl that was in my bed the other day who was like making me love offerings and everything? I was hungover, confused. Oh, really? Well, now you're sober and you're even more confused. Greenlee, this, this drive that you have to make it work with Juan Pablo is a death wish. You bastard. Hey. All right, okay, let's just say for the sake of argument that you do love Juan Pablo, and he loves you too. There's no future in it, darling. There's no future. He's a walking dead man. What, you want to commit to a guy who's not even going to make it to next year? Losing Leo almost killed you. What, are you trying to finish the job? Look. If, if you saw someone that you truly cared about, that was getting ready to jump into a fiery volcano, would you warn them about the molten lava or would you just say bon voyage? You're, you're, sta you're, you're staring down the mouth of the volcano, Greenlee. You gotta step back. All right, this, this, this whole thing with Pablo is headed for a really, really bad ending. I don't want you anywhere near the bullets when they start flying. You have to know how I feel about you. I need you alive and in my life. Now please, let me protect you. Again, tell me how I can make it feel better. <laughs>